So I was about to go to bed, and then I saw a video saying something about how Batman has apparently been turned into Twilight. I click on the video, and it apparently it's a trailer. The guy's talking, and he's about to watch the trailer, and I'm like, wait, wait, wait. I'd rather just watch it myself first. So it's called Gotham High. You just type it in. It's like the first video. So I typed it in, clicked on this, and I'm like, I should record this because I know whatever is going to happen will be a fucking dumpster fire. Apparently, the ratio, I mean, it's pretty even right now, but the fact that the dislikes outweigh the likes, um, let that be a sign. So, it's 46 seconds, let's just get right into it. It's called Gotham High, and I'm guessing it's a comic, so here we go. Welcome to Gotham High, where everyone worships the rich and the beautiful. And no one is richer or more handsome than Bruce Wayne. He doesn't have friends, he has followers. My friend Jack Napier has nothing to his name, except good looks and a wicked sense of humor. The problem is that I love them both. I'm Selena Kyle, that girl next door. And in my opinion, a triangle is a perfect shape. That, right there. I'm guessing that's Bruce right there. Bruce's face and his position is exactly how I feel right now. This. Mm. Okay. Melissa de la Cruz. Mm. Okay. So. Let's go back. Uh, yeah, we'll leave it right there. Okay, so they've turned it into Twilight. So you've got all your favorite Batman characters, but they're teenagers in high school. First off, wouldn't Bruce Wayne be like in a private school or homeschool? I seriously doubt. As rich as he is, and as rich as his parents are, they would just have him in a regular school. He would be in a private school, getting the best education possible, not in a fucking high school, regular high school. So, minus 50,000 points just for that. And then we have, like, this fucking love triangle between Selena, Jack, and Bruce. Is she gonna flip-flop like it's gonna be like Twilight, where, oh... I have this best friend, like, Jack's gonna be her best friend since, like, you know, for ages, and then Bruce comes by looking constipated, and she's gonna fall for him, and then Jack's gonna get upset, which, I mean, now we know why Jack shot Bruce's parents after all that time. He just couldn't handle the fact that Selena picked him. Are... Oh my god. This is a steaming pile of cat and bat and joker shit. Oh my god. Okay, I need to find out. Let's see here. Uh, no, that's not what I want. Melissa de la Cruz. I'm not going to bring it up because you guys can just kind of do it on your own. But I want to see what this Melissa de la Cruz looks like and who this Thomas Pitt Illy. Melissa de la Cruz. Let's see. Come on. Well, she looks like the kind of person who would enjoy Twilight. So, yeah, you can go and look up that. And then who it Thomas Pitt 
uh, Patilli. Patilli. Riverdale. Riverdale. And he looks like your typical fucking hipster. So, let that show what this is about. So, she looks like the kind of person who likes Twilight. He looks like your typical... Oh, I don't identify as anything fucking hipster. So, this is where we're at. Twilight Batman. Why? Why can we not just have good stories? Are these... It's almost like Marvel... Let me go back because I hate the way the freaking thing's going on here with the light. Yeah, whatever. Okay, there we go. It's almost like Marvel, and I was about to say Capcom. Marvel Capcom! I love those games back in the day. Um, it's like Marvel and DC want to go out of business. It's like they're just sitting around saying, what will piss off the fans the most? Oh, I know. Let's make people superheroes named Safe Space and Snowflake. And have internet gas, whatever the fuck internet gas is. And Marvel goes with that. And then DC is like, well, they're trying to end their careers. What can we do on our side to end our careers over here? Let's make Twilight Batman. People hate Twilight. It's it's perfect. Is Batman gonna sparkle? Is 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 Jack secretly gonna be a werewolf? Is Selena gonna be like that awkward? She's just, just gonna, you know, she's just gonna, you know, do this all the time. This is, this is the point comic books are at. This is shit you try when you first start making comics, not after you've had, what, Batman's been around since what the forties, fifties, with uh, detective comics, and when it was just detective comics. So you're taking an established character that has been around for almost a hundred years and you're making him into a teenager in high school. Oh boy, all the zany, wacky adventures that will ensue. So... Mm. They, just, they just don't care anymore. They keep hiring these fucking diversity hires you keep doing that, you're gonna get shit like this. You're gonna get shit like Gotham High. You're gonna get shit like the New Warriors. You're gonna get shit like uh, Children of the Atom. You're gonna get shit like every other fucking piece of shit superhero that they put out. Rather than taking established characters and making stories or just making new characters that are interesting. I mean... <laughs> okay, I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm going to call it now, and I would love to see this. They're taking Batman back to his childhood years, right? His his high school years. What's next? Are we going to be set in the future? Are we going to see Batman, Jack, uh, Selina all in a fucking retirement home and all the zany adventures they're having there? Racing down the hallways in wheelchairs? I mean, come on. Come on. What the fuck is this shit? This isn't Batman. This is not fucking Batman. This is Twilight, with fucking Batman slapped on it. Come on, DC. Come on. But, what do I know? I'm just a fat guy who makes videos. Anyways, what do you guys think? Are you interested in this 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 bullshit right here, or is this something you know like a like a cold or something you'd rather just not get? Let me know below. Thumbs up, thumbs down, comment, subscribe, all that great stuff, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.